lordship this matter is regarding the post of constable your lordship post of constable ha so an advertisement or shoot and uh, petitioner applied for the advertisement he qualified the examination and he was given the joining letter your lordship after the when he went to join uh, his post he was not allowed to join because it was said there was a criminal case uh, pending against him your lordship so, uh, there was a uh, uh, criminal case against him your lordship this is which department a uh, police police स्टेबल He was appointed on the post of radio constable operator Bhopal, and his posting was given under Unit SSP. During the verification of testimonial and character certificate of the petitioner, it was found that he is having a criminal case registered in crime number three zero one of the fourteen at police station Kotwali. Although the petitioner has been acquitted from charge, but the acquittal was on, only on the basis of the compromise entered into between the parties. The just same does not. Just mobile is ringing. He was appointed for radio constable operator Bhopal. Yeah. His posting was given under U. Unit S. P. Yeah. During the verification of testimonial and character certificate of the petitioner, it was found that he is having a criminal case registered in crime number such and such at police station Kotwali. Take one question to you. Lordship. Uh, when were you appointed? I was given joining on 2014. Your lordship. 2015. Your lordship. P four page twenty per the petition ke saath. Or just a year before there was a criminal case against. Yes, sir. All and right. he was acquitted on the basis of compromise, your lordship. All right. Huh. Lord. Although the petition has been acquitted. Huh. Although, <coughs> and time to back, the same does not amount to an honourable acquittal, even otherwise. Huh. It is within the domain of the employer to consider the suitable. For your lordship. Hmm. Ah. The same does not amount to clear acquittal, even otherwise. As per the dictum of Honorable Supreme Court in the case of Aftar Singh, the guideline have been framed wherein the Honorable Supreme Court have categorically observed that it is within the domain of employer to consider the candidature of the candidate like petitioner and is having a right to refuse or issuance of appointment or permit him to join in view of the criminal antecedent. Okay, now you tell me. Tell me. What was the offence? The offence was under your Lord Sir Section one forty seven. One forty-eight, one forty-nine, three twenty-three, two ninety-four, five zero six B, and four four seven of IPC or lordship. Oh. And when he filled up filled up the form or lordship, he gave the due uh, information regarding this criminal case registered against him or lordship. But the honourable single bench has recorded. No, no, we are not on a point of suppression of material. We are on a point whether, despite there being a compromise. Can you be said to be fit for police services? Because every service has its own has its own discipline, and police discipline, as perceived by the Honorable Supreme Court and by us also, is a disciplined force. And person involved in some activity which may tend to amount to moral turpitude. Or may also affect the character of a person, or a mindset of a person. Whether such person who is found to have violated law, in with a with a with a with with some overt act, or with some act which tend amounts to which which may reflect the criminality of the person, criminality in the mindset of a person. But this such person is fit to be kept as a police person. See, if you see Joginder Singh's case, probably as a DDS case, the uh, Delhi uh, Delhi administration case, that man was having a hockey stick, and he had brandished it, and also had broken the window panes of the bus while intending to hit the passenger sitting inside. so there was either compromise or acquittal 
but it's still the Supreme Court has said that such person who, who indulges in such activity with an overt act is not, has rightly been found to be not fit to be in the employment for police. Now, in your case, maybe you have only caused simple hurt or alleged to have caused simple hurt. But you were part of an unlawful assembly armed with weapons. So there was a common, there was a motive. And intention might have been deferred on the spot, but motive was common. When you all went all together, to cause injury to the uh, injured person. So this could be the reason for the management or the department to say that this man who, who is of this kind, that he's armed with a weapon with common motive for becoming and became a member of an unlawful assembly and attacked a person, though only simple hurt was found to have been caused. And you face trial. But during trial, things have been compromised. So you show me the law related to such kind of persons can also be admitted uh, in police services. Because which, the one which I have given you talks about police services. Do you please look into that judgment and then address us? The concept for the appellant, please for time. Just after two weeks. Because it is not merely, acquittal is not sufficient. sufficient. And that too based on compromise.